You're watching Adorama TV. Hi everybody, welcome to this week's episode of Adorama TV product reviews. Well, as a kid, two of my favorite toys, one was a chemistry set and the other was a microscope, but my microscope wasn't anywhere near as fancy as the microscope I'm gonna show you today. And you're probably asking, what the heck does a microscope have to do with photography? Well, this is no ordinary microscope. This is the Celestron LCD Deluxe Digital Microscope with a built-in digital camera. It's right here, it has this really nice dust cover. So let me take that off really quickly so you can actually see the microscope. So here it is, it is a microscope and a digital camera all in one. Now this whole kit, it comes with a case and a stylus and some slides and a bunch of stuff. It's all uh, for about 250 bucks. And if uh, you realize like I did last week that Christmas, unbelievably, is approaching pretty darn quickly, well, and now's the time to maybe start looking at some ideas for the people in your life that you'd like to buy gifts for. Now, uh, if you have somebody that has an inquisitive mind, you might want to look at this microscope. It's pretty cool. Now, the thing I love about this, um, we got it in, I've been playing with it quite a bit, probably too much actually, because it's pretty fascinating. Uh, it has all kinds of neat stuff. So let me start by talking to you about this top screen here. It's a swivel screen, it rotates 180 degrees, and uh, on this screen is a three and a half inch touch screen. So it actually comes with a stylus. So here's a little stylus, and this works like uh, a, an older Windows CE device, I guess. So you can touch the screen here with the stylus, and based on where you touch, you get different options. And so you can control the whole microscope right from the touch screen. It's really, really cool. Now this does not only still photos, but it does pictures and video. And this is a five megapixel still camera, so it's 1600 by 1200 pixels. And the nice thing is, it has a one gigabyte uh, internal memory card built in, so you can use that, or there's an SD card slot on the side here. So if you prefer, you can actually put your own SD card in, so you can use uh, however large of a card that you want. And then it also has a USB slot, so you can connect it directly to a computer. So if you're using the internal memory, you can just keep transferring stuff over. So it's really, really nice. Right out of the box, you can start shooting and making some photos. Now the neat thing is uh, we use all these slides. So they have a bunch of prepared slides here, things like a sliced apple and the epidermis, so some skin, and there's, uh, there's like, like some wood pine that we have in here right now. And I took a bunch of shots, and so we're gonna show you those. So these shots are the actual shots that we took with this microscope, and it's really, really simple to do that. And not only do you, uh, can you take still photos, but again, you can take video. Now the video is not nearly as high of a resolution, uh, but it works pretty good, and it's an awesome teaching tool. Now, uh, let me just sort of walk you through how this microscope, the different features that it has. So it's got a quadruple nose piece. So on the front here, there are actually four lenses. So there is a 4X, a 10X, a 20X, and a 40X. And there's also a 4X digital zoom, uh, but the optical zooms are gonna work just fine. And so uh, basically what you do is you choose which stage you want that on. And then you can go in here and then on the side, in fact, let me put this case down. This case, uh, the whole thing goes in this case. It's really nice and rugged with a handle. Well, let me just put that to the side really quickly. Um, on the side here, what we have, we have two knobs, and so we have a rough adjustment knob, so that really lets you move the uh, slide up and down to get focus, and then you have a fine adjustment knob right here, so once you get it pretty close, then you can fine tune that. So I'm gonna get this really close, there it is, and then I'll just fine tune it, and voila, now I can see what's on my slide. Now the other thing that's really nice is the, uh, the actual slide is illuminated by an adjustable LED light. So on the side here, I'll just move this. There's this little light right here that you can move around. It's an LED light that lights the top of what you're looking at. And then there's a light below that also illuminates that. And there are two different uh, controls, one on the side that controls the bottom light. And there's one on the other side that controls the top light. So you can control the illumination. And the other thing that's pretty cool, and I'll see if you can see both of these at the same time, are there's these two little dials here. And so one of them moves your slide specimen back and forth, and the other one moves it left and right. And so you can really, really move things around in minute detail to really get into exactly what you wanna see, and then make sure you focus that really finely. So a lot of really cool controls. And the other thing on the other side here, there is actually a, a dial right here. And what that allows you to do is to use uh, different diaphragms to change the illumination and maybe increase the contrast of your image based on uh, the uh, color of the light that's coming through. So it's really, really nice. There are also some things that you can do here. You can uh, use, there's some digital controls to change the color so you can get higher contrast images, maybe using uh, a sepia or a black and white or some other things just by clicking that. I can 
change how that looks and so maybe I get a little bit nicer view of what's in there so I can zip around. So it's really, really cool. Now what comes with this, in addition to uh, the wood pine slide I have there, again I mentioned earlier, there's seven pieces, so there's a bunch of prepared slides. So if you don't know how to prepare slides, you're just curious, um, that comes right in the box. And you can also buy additional slides of all types of things, or you know, just make your own by ordering some slides that are blank. And so you can put whatever you want in there. Now the thing is, this works on an AC adapter. So we've got it plugged in right now to the wall. So it runs on an AC adapter that comes with it. Or you can run it on batteries. So you can use a couple uh, four AA batteries right there in the bottom. So if you're out and about, maybe uh, in the field and you want to look at something and take pictures, you can do that with some AA batteries as well. And the other thing that's really nice about this is it works anywhere in the world, virtually anywhere in the world. So the AC adapter comes with different uh, connectors. And so depending on where you are in the world, if you're in Asia or Europe or the United States or South America, wherever you, you are, uh, well, this will work. So the adapter is 110 as well as 240 volts. And so uh, this works pretty much anywhere in the world. It's really, really nice. So if you're like me and you're really curious and you like to dig in, or maybe you know uh, somebody who's younger that is also very curious and wants to see some things, or maybe you're a teacher and you need a, a device that allow you to uh, do some really nice training and getting some still uh, photos to put in some presentations. I mean, there's all kinds of uses for this digital camera microscope that I can think of. One, just because it's really, really fun and cool to use. Well, the whole thing, again, is the Celestron LCD Di uh, Deluxe digital microscope with a built-in digital camera. The whole package, the box and the slides and everything that comes along with this is $250. And I've just had a blast. I'm not sure if we're going to send this back because I'm having so much fun just putting stuff underneath there and looking at it. So there you have it. I highly suggest it. This probably could make an awesome uh, Christmas present or a present for uh, a birthday present, uh, uh, maybe a young student. This is going to be a great tool for them. Well, thanks so much for joining me and having a look at a different kind of digital camera, one that I really like. Remember, if you have questions about digital photography or just photography gear in general, you can send those to me at askmark at adorama.com and we might just answer your question on an upcoming episode. Well, thanks again for joining me and I'll see you again next week. This episode is brought to you by Adorama TV. Visit the Adorama Learning Center where you'll find photography tips and techniques, links to the gear used in this episode and related videos. For all the latest photography, video and computer gear, visit adorama.com. And the next time you're in New York City, visit our store located on 18th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue.